Increasingly, questions are being asked about how we teach our children. Are they being taught a deep understanding of knowledge or just to pass exams? It's this problem the Open University has been trying to solve with its tricky topic tool research project, looking at problem areas in learning. Tricky topics help you identify what is a problem area for understanding and then you can, once you've identified what it is and measured the level of understanding for a learner, you can then put in whatever intervention to help them progress their understanding, gain further deeper understanding of that topic. So we used in JuxtaLearn creative video making so the students would have a, um, an engagement in their own language of that topic. Here, Year 7 and 8 students are using the tricky topic tool and creative video making to get a deeper understanding of fractions. They won the Champions League final fractions. Throughout the project, there's been a particular focus on STEM subjects. Yeah, so if you're finished, press upload and wait, and it will take a second to do it. So that should now be uploaded to the website. So if, if you've got an iPad, you should be able to see that, and you can go away and do the filming stage now. So it's the tricky topic tool that helps focus the fun on the deeper understanding, on those tricky topics. It helps break down the tricky topic and it helps focus them so that they can't just go off and, and talk about their latest game. They focus on the problems within that tricky topic. The students don't just create a fun film. They create one that has the key components of what the teachers need them to understand. It's interesting to see the small misconceptions that they make and that only came out through this process it, because sometimes it's there but you don't see it because they can cover it up with their work in the books but when you give them that opportunity to go in more detail you can actually see that underneath there is still things that needs to be um, uh, sorted and that was good to see. And it's been proved that this approach helped the lower ability students who had previously been disengaged. The school kids here, the ones that took part in, the, in, in this project, they have definitely benefited from it. They have learned maths in a way that they haven't learned before and they feel more confident with it because it's their own way to do it. It has definitely proven to me that it is a way forward. So the schools are using the videos to help um, other um, younger children when they come to understand some of the topics. Um, they're also sharing them um, by, uh, with other schools and helping um, other teachers to understand about tricky topics and what are the likely tricky topics, but also different creative ways of teaching. So what does Anne Adams see as the big potential of the tricky topic tool approach? I think the big potential is with regard to changing teacher training and teachers and their approach to teaching. Sometimes teachers are scared of taking um, and being adventurous um, because they think it will not advance their students' learning. And in fact, what we've proved is it does. And by identifying key areas where you focus on these creative approaches rather than having to change all of your teaching practices, then we're going to be able to actually advance teaching and stop this sort of rote learning approach, which is just what predominates. Thank <laughs> you.